Hi there! This is a 100% playthrough of Altars of Madness on Ultra Violence Difficulty. This is map number 12 Hyperventilation System. Let's go, boys. Nab, nab, nab. Last map. Let's get pumped. Mm, Rachno does not want to fire. He only wants to fire when I'm around, you know. He gets nervous in front of other people. Are arachnotrons he? I don't know. I suppose they're sexless. They're just a blob. They're just a brain blob. Don't imagine they have sexual organs. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe the um, the mastermind just sort of squeezes them out. Maybe she... Whoa! I saw that coming and I moved into it. Because of course I did. Maybe she sort of does the, uh, does the frog thing and impregnates herself asexually and then squeezes them out. He did it again! He did it again! Because I'm talking about the sexual practices of a spider mastermind over here. Sorry, spider demon. Right, Mr. Beefy. You gotta go. We got two secrets. One up there where the flames are. There's rockets, which is nice. And a megasphere over there, which is very nice. But it's, it's easy to grab. But tagging the sector is an absolute biatch, as uh, as Dread Wanderer will be able to confirm in his video. It takes a number of attempts, and yeah. You guys in fighting? I'm not too sure what you're doing. Oh well. Blast me! Oh, okay. I wasn't sure what was going on there. Whoa, and I got stuck to something. Possibly a torch sticking out the wall? I don't know. I like the yellow torch edition. That looks really tasty. Nice. Um, let's go. Onwards and upwards, ladies and gents. Let's grab some health. Yum yum. Yeah, I see you there, Megasphere. I'll see you in a moment. Armor's still looking pretty yummy. That's good. Let's grab this. <laughs> of course, I instantly take damage. Now, Arachnos, Revenants, Hell Knights, Imps, Pain Elementals. My Alden has opened up the big family bag of monsters. Whoa. And said, I'll take the lot. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's just keep circling. I want the Lost Souls all dead, please. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm just walking back into fireballs now. Okay, sweet. Sweet. Let's just keep moving. Just keep jessying from side to side. I don't know if that's an actual verb, but I've possibly just made one up. And that is a verb relating to the doom practice of moving from one side of an arena to the other. Named after Lady Jessica... Um, uh, Lady Jessica. And um, she's very good at this. Um, I don't know what I'm saying. Two arch vials. No. Yes, expose your soft white underbelly to me, you stinky alien. No! No, and don't you block me either, you bean. Yeah, let's have some of this yum, 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 yum. Groove E. Uh, other side. Blue key. Beep, beep, beep. I guess I'll grab the Megasphere now. I might just have to worry about tagging the sector later, though. I don't know. Because I don't really want to lose health unnecessarily. Because it's kind of a pisser. Oh, I did it! <laughs> well, now I'll die in this fight and it'll be for nothing. So, there's that, I suppose. Oh, and of course I take extra damage anyway. Nap, nap. 
two arch piles in here. Huge, huge pile of bad guys. It's a big old chaotic mess. Um, still yet to figure out a particularly reliable way of dealing with it. Let's go. Let's heck and go. Let's heck and go. Get out of my face. Blast me. Blast me. Blast me. Blast me. Blast me. Or not. Step on me. Step on me. I've got a smile on my face. <laughs> you can't tell. This has got the heart going. Let's grab that. Okay. I love how vibrant and colourful this map is. My Olden's use of colour throughout this entire map set is insanely good. Which I don't need to tell you if you've been watching or if you've played this or if you have eyes of your own, but um, I'm telling you anyway. Okay, nasty little revs. I'm gonna try and sneak them. Hopefully before they sneak me. A few more. Yep, yeah. Hot sausage. Um, now, yeah, this bit threw me off a fair, fair bit, <laughs> despite the fact that I knew what was coming. We lower this down, BFG. I'm going to try and hug the wall as much as possible to grab it early. Then I'm going to run in here, which I assume is maybe what you're supposed to do. I'm going to lose health and stuff to the nukage. But there's more room in here to actually turn around and pop Revenant missiles. Although we have quite a stack following us now. <laughs> okay, that was a thing that happened. Oh, and more. You can have some of this. Anyone else? Grab, 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 grab. Okay, we're in a um, bit of BFG country. Don't want to waste it all though. Just a variety of different bad guys coming in. Cyberdemon on the big red cube, and then there'll be a second wave of Cacodemons, Hell Knights around. So let's just, let's just bloody do it. Oh, I have to, <laughs> I have to do it myself. I'm just making a mess of this, though. Nope. Mmm. Okay. I'm not entirely sure if this is timed or if it's when the Cyberdemon dies. But, mmm. Hell night. Mate. Let's grab a whole bunch of stuff. Please stop getting me with your splash damage, you big penis. Okay, Hell Knight, I need you... Where has he gone? Oh, he's dead. No, he's not. Go away! Okay. Actually, yeah, let's... Come on, auto aim. Uh oh. Uh oh. I think I kind of wasted my cells a little bit. How did I get under them? Nope. It's horseshoe to a certain extent. Nah, you're all too close. Go away. Give me some space. 
Cacos, Papa Eduardo needs some space. Okay, infighting, that's tasty, that's sexy, I love it, I love it, you're beautiful darling, you're beautiful. Oh, last dude! <sighs> yeah, that's delicious. That was map number 12. What's it called? Hyperventilation system. And that was... Altars of Madness, which has made me feel very Altars of Gladness that I have managed to finish that. Um, deathless in each map, I think, if memory serves. Um, that's certainly what I was striving for. I wasn't sure if I would be able to necessarily, but I'm glad I knew when to take a break on certain maps and when to come back, even just like an hour later. Like, I, um, I played 11 and 12 and recorded them both in this one session. Eleven was giving me a lot of trouble this afternoon and I was just getting so frustrated and then I took a break, had a delicious juicy steak and chips. Mmm, very nice. And then I was like, actually I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna give another go. And I did it in one, one shot, which was great. And then this one here, I practiced it for maybe about uh, 20 minutes and then I, I think it took three attempts. Uh, so um, actually this one is an absolute banger, but I find it easier than the previous map. And let's not forget, thank you for playing. Look at all these torches. Wow! Spin the mouse. Sorry, I'll stop doing that. Thank you so much, my olden, for making this. This is absolutely delicious. This hits the spot for anyone craving a bit of sunlust, um, like a short order sunlust or something of that persuasion, but it has so much of an identity of its own that you'd be a fool to compare it as such beyond just the, um, the very surface level. It's got these iconic fights, of course, tight squeezes, and it is a case of just identifying for each and every fight what you need to do. Who do you need to kill and in what order and when and how to get out if that is a possibility. Thank you so much for making this, man, and um, I've had a ball. I really hope people do play it as well. And a huge thank you to um, Dread Wanderer as well. I watched his playthroughs for a couple of maps when I was a bit stumped as to strategies and it helped so much, especially for the previous map. Um, in, in the case of like, just don't fight the monsters, just get out of there, fool, which was so helpful and saved, saved, uh, saved my sanity. This map was great. Really fun, map 12 I'm talking about. Beautiful tune, very colorful, great way of sending off the map set without the need for an icon of sin or any ridiculously scorching boss encounter, which I'm hugely grateful for. Instead, it was just fun, which is all I can ask for at the end of the day from a Doom map set, and it's delivered in spades. I'm gonna keep my eyes out for anything else uh, my olden has done and is doing and will be doing in the future because I'd love to explore those as well. He certainly made the cheekiest, naughtiest, nastiest maps in Daylight District. So um, I wonder what he's got planned for the future. Hmm. Thanks for watching for everyone who's watched along the way or just this video or even just this bit of this video. I'll um, see you in the next project. See ya. Eduardo and friends.